This is our Bright Future Learning Center. It was constructed in 2003. It was a library at the time, and as time has passed and our superintendent and school board have thought about what they want these buildings to be, we've changed them to Bright Future Learning Centers. It looks a lot different. There's all this great seating, and so now these kids want to be in here. And you're seeing a lot of kids in here now who would not typically come in here. So it used to be before. All the tables were the same. They were all the same height. Couldn't move anything. But these tables move up and down, and they're on wheels, so they can move wherever. We do have a particular student who's in a really tall wheelchair, and it is a challenge for him um, everywhere he goes, him and his aide, to find seating. And so they come in now, and we have a table back here that we leave higher, and he's able to roll right under it. So this has become, you know, his space now. This where I'm at right now is kind of like the tinkering section. And so you'd have the tools over there. You have these bins full of just everything. Like there's Legos, and then over here are these little bits, which are just little circuits that you can put together and do all kinds of stuff with. And then over there is kind of the 3D printing area. And then over there we have Raspberry Pis, which are mini computers basically. You can plug them into a monitor and you can program them to do stuff. And then here is kind of like a reading area and the center maybe like you could do homework, read a book, and then the chairs, there's chairs for everyone. Like I like the gray chairs the most, but other people like these green stools or the couches or the flex chairs. We're trying to push the envelope with our kids and, and how they come out of middle school, how they're educated. They needed an area to go learn how to um, collaborate, to build things as teams, to engineer, to make models, to uh, pr do presentations, to revise models. They needed an area to do this outside of their classroom. And if we can do that with them as new jobs open up and become available to them that we haven't even thought of yet, they're gonna have the skill set to be able to do those jobs. The world's changing and we have to do things to stay up with the changes in the world.